Now this afternoon, Circuit Court Judge Samuel Bright Aqua is uh, making a strong case for the judiciary to take a strong stance against illegal mining, ruling on a bail application for lawyers uh, for Galamse Kim Penaisha Juan. Justice Aqua said the future of the nation is under threat. He indicated that the accused will therefore remain in police custody as investigations continue. Ms. Hua and three others are accused of engaging in illegal mining and engaging in the sale of minerals without license. They have pleaded not guilty but remain in police custody. Court correspondent Joseph Akable joins me in studio with the latest uh, on this. Now, Joseph, tell us about uh, how lawyers for the Chinese nationals question the work done by prosecutors. In fact, uh, Mr. Nkrabi Efadate, who is the lead counsel for Aisha Wan, had some serious concerns about the work done by investigators. He indicated that he does not understand why they need a month to investigate such a matter. He believes that if the investigators were to ask the accused persons, do you have license for the mining that you engaged in? A yes or no answer should inform what step they take next. And so he doesn't understand why they need more than a month. And so he told the court that should they grant bail, not even the president or the attorney general can say anything that will affect that decision of the court. And so he urged the courts to grant them bail. Mm. But we understand the prosecutors also had questions. Yes, in fact, they said that Investigations have so far revealed that the accused persons entered the country illegally. And so that is enough evidence to show that should the court exercise its powers to grant them bail, there is the potential that they may not show up to stand trial. And so it's in the interest of justice that they remain in police custody while investigations continue. Mm -hmm. The judge also made some interesting comments there. Yes, I mean, let me read specifically what he had to say. He said that... Uh, this is an activity that is destroying our water bodies. Look at how it is destroying our forest. We the humans are complaining. The animals in the forest are suffering. It's very sad. If this should go on, Ghana Water says they will soon shut their machines and will have to import water to drink. The court and everyone must take a strong stance. A1 especially, that is Aisha Wang. How she entered the country, she can't even tell. If I grant bail and tomorrow the case is called and she can't be found, what happens? The motion for bail is refused. And so, I mean, clearly expressing some serious concerns about the illegal mining activity that remains a matter of concern for organics. Mm. Looks like he brought in some personal sentiment there. Yes, I mean, definitely. <laughs> All right, thank you very much.